Hello and welcome to our toggle class JavaScript example using jQuery. jQuery is a library that will help us implement the toggle class method, which will allow us to toggle between adding and removing a class to a selected element. First thing, we'll create a folder that's going to house our toggle class example. Let's do it here. Next, we could open our code editor. Let's open our project in our code editor that we just created. Should be an empty folder. And it's already selected. And it's already selected, so we just open it. Close out all of these other ones. Here we would create a file, toggle class HTML. Next we get some boilerplate to outline our HTML skeleton. Just grab this one, and it will work, but this is just a quick skeleton. Paste it. Next, we're going to want to grab our jQuery link to link to the library and our HTML to have access to the toggle class method. W3Schools should have the link. We'll just add this group tag to our head section. We should now have access to the jQuery library, which has the toggle class method. So now let's create some text for our body, which is going to change once we toggle a button. So first we can add a button to the top with some paragraphs that will change once the button is clicked. Let's go ahead and remove this script tag. And let's do our button and paragraphs that will change when the button is toggled. So these P elements will start with no class on them. Once the button is pressed, it should add to any P elements the color blue. So first we're going to have to create a style that will have the class which we will add to our elements. Let's do that here. So there's our style. Next, let's add the script which will run the jQuery function which will allow us to toggle the dot toggle blue class on and off of our paragraph element. Let's do that now. So here we're basically saying once the document's ready, we wait for the button to be clicked. And once the button is clicked, P elements will have the toggle blue class toggled on and off each time it's clicked. So let us see if that's going to work. Let's save our code. Let's minimize. Go here and open our example. So if this works, once we click this, it should change it to blue. And it looks like this isn't working. And that's because we're not linking to the correct file. And what we can use is the CDN. Using the CDN, you'll be able to load it straight from the server here versus here you would download it directly into your local environment to have quicker access to it. But for our example here we're fine with going over here and then just replacing here with that other script tag which gives us the location of that file on this server here which is a link to the jQuery files. So now this should work. Let's save it. Let's go back out here. Simple troubleshooting. Okay. Let's see what happens. We are achieving what we're trying to do. And that is a simple way of implementing the toggle class using jQuery and JavaScript. If you enjoyed that, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.